about to go live. Here it happens. This is how it happens, Jack. Here we go. I forget what to say. Oh, you won't have to say anything. We're just gonna, what it's gonna do is gonna let your followers know that Uncle Jack is going live on Instagram. So here it happens. So the way it works, if you see this, if you see this number right up here, you see this number up here? Yeah. That one there? That's how many people are on live with you right On now. the red, the red you mean? Next to the red. So right now there's oh. 282, 290 people here with us. Wow. So you can, can say, you can say hi to your friends right now. Be nuts. So hello everybody, <laughs> hello. Hey, they're only as nuts as us. I would say they're only as crazy as you and I are. Hello everybody, hello. Hello is the breakfast of Joro your day. Oh, hello, everybody. Hello. Hello, shampoo. Hello. Well done. Well done, Jack. Well done. I Bravo. I that over the radio years ago, Damon. Bravo. You guys give Uncle Jack some love. Come on, give him some love right now. Bravo. See? Look. See? So, Jack, when you see these hearts, because now we're on Instagram. We're not on TikTok anymore. I see. So now here you'll see Ooh, white look hearts. Look at them. When you see the white hearts, that's what we like. Oh, do we? Oh, look at them. Yes. Oh, the white hearts. Yes. So what you're going to also see is a bunch of messages coming in. And these are your friends just saying hello. Hello, everyone. Thank you. Uh, Captain Jake says, just wanted to write saying you're a great person, Jack. Hmm, it's so nice to say that. Yep. How can he, it's a good thing he don't know me. Well, remember, all of these people see your videos, Jack. So they see your yeah. videos, and they get to know a little bit more about your personality and, and who you are. I see. Yeah, I get it. Isn't that interesting? Oh, yes. It's just fascinating. Yes. And Jack, someone's asking here, how long until you turn 100 years old? Well, it's just the end of the month. And it, well, July, so in the summertime. Mm -hmm. Yep, Uncle Jack will be a hundred this summer, actually. Right, I'll be a hundred this summer. Yep. And I ain't a bummer. Yep. Hey, so what we like to do, usually we're live on TikTok. Uncle Jack has like over a million followers on TikTok, if you can imagine. Uh, so we decided we'd come over and hang out with you guys on Instagram Live for a minute and see what it was like. Um, what we like to start out with is what? We like to start out with a little bit of roll call. Can you let us know where you're from? Can you can you put it in the chat and tell us where you're from? What city or what country? Let's see. We're all, turning nocturnal. We're turning. I forgot to tell you, we're turning nocturnal. <laughs> all right, let's see. Here we go, Jack. We're going to find out where you are from. July 31st. I'm not where you're from, where people are from. Okay, here it comes. We got Kentucky. We got Miles in Kentucky. We got Evan in Canada. We've got Canada. Sri is in India, Jack. Look, all wow, in India. India. Yep. We've got Drew in England. We've got Riley in Wisconsin. Stephanie's in Sacramento. We've got North Carolina in the house. Indiana, Tennessee, Missouri. We've got Zero is in Quebec, Canada, Jack. Wow. Ontario, Canada. We've got, um, let's see here. We've got, oh, Ali Stone is in Hong Kong. Wow, Hong Kong. I love Hong Kong. I've been to Hong Kong. It's one of my favorite places. Oh, have you, David? You've been to Hong Kong. Yep. That's all Chinese, Kong. isn't it? Yep, it's a Chinese country. Yeah, yep. yeah. Uh, we've got people here in Pakistan and Australia. Wow. Kentucky and Wales, all the way in China Wales. China town, my China town, when the lights are low. Very nice. You might get a song every once in a while hanging out with Uncle yeah, you, Jack, guys. You never know. You never know what's about to happen. <laughs> uh, Sydney says, hello, Jack. British Columbia. We've got Southern Italy. Wow. We've got uh, Mexico in the house. Jack, have you ever been to Michigan? No. No? Mm -mm. No. Well, how, why would I go to Michigan? We've got someone here from Kyrgyzstan. Kyrgyzstan. Hello, T.O. Jack. Hello there. Oh, hello there. Yes. Hey, yeah. Uncle Jack, the Super Bowl is this weekend. Football. Are you excited to watch no. the Super Bowl? No. I don't <laughs> give a damn about that. <laughs> Come on, Playing don't you? Little, let's play with a little bouncy ball, do you, shall we? 
Do you want to pick a team who's going to win? No. No, not at all. Okay. Um, we've got Oregon in the house. We've got Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Jack Mill 0781 says, how was your day today, Jack? How was your day today? It was boring until Damon showed up, my great nephew, and he makes everything seem good. Everything. My boredom goes away, <laughs> never to come back. Thank you, sir. <laughs> That's what I mean. Hey, guys, if you're just meeting us right now, we really appreciate you stopping by. Uh, oh, we've got someone here from India, Jack. Wow. Jendra. India. Jendra. Lovely Sandra. to meet you. I can't believe we're able to speak to someone from here in California all the way in India right now. Wow. And connect. Isn't that something? It's just amazing. Mm, just amazing. Uh, Lily Mona. Hola, Damien. Hello, Lily. Nice to meet you. So my name is Damon. And if you're just meeting us, this is Uncle Jack. Right? Mm-hmm. And Uncle Jack is my great uncle. Uh, there's a follow button up here somewhere. Go ahead and follow us and hang out with us. And do me a favor, keep smashing that like button if you can. That lets other people know that we're online. Um, and let's go ahead and do a this or that. Should we do a this or that, Jack? A what? A this or that. That's where people can suggest like Pepsi or Coke. Okay, yeah, let's do a this yeah. or that. All right, so how about this? Do you guys want to do a this or that with Uncle Jack? If you'd like to do a this or that with Uncle Jack, go ahead and put... This or that, but not a big rat. But not a big rat. True. So go ahead, drop it in the comments right now, and I'll read them to Uncle Jack. Here we go. Are you ready, Jack? Yes. Pizza or pasta? Uh, pizza. There we go. Let's see here. What else we got? We're going to see here. Here comes a bunch of them. I can tell. Yes. Lily, you're down. Miles is down. Okay, guys, drop them in. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Okay. Let's see here. Squash or zucchini? Oh, zucchini. Bambini. Fries or chips? Uh, fries. Tea or coffee? Coffee. Night steel. Good one. Winter or summer? Summer. Mm -hmm. You old Indian summer. <laughs> live in the live in the desert or in the tropics? Oh gosh, I don't know. I like them both, Damon. Uh, tropics. Ooh, I didn't think you'd say that. Okay, Dr Pepper or Pepsi? Dr Pepper. Mm -hmm. Sweet or spicy? Spicy and everything icy. Mm. Pink or purple? Purple. Indoors or outdoors? Outdoors. Baseball or football? Neither. <laughs> the forest or the mountains? The, oh, Damon, that's hard to answer. The mountain. Okay. But uh, I love the forest, too. I like the rain forest. Mm. Fried or scrambled? Scrambled. Very good. Coke or Pepsi? Coke. There you go. Uh, Dr. Pepper, hooray! Yes, I agree. Chevy or Ford? Oh, Chevy. There you go. Very nice. Um, let's see here. Hunting or fishing? Fishing. Very good. Knives or guns? Uh, gun. All right. Una pistola. Una pistola. Uh, rain or snow? Rain. There you go. Wherever you go. The mountains of New Mexico or the flatlands of Texas? I want the montaña. The montaña. See. Si. There you go. Uh, a guitar or a bass guitar? Oh, just a guitar. Just like you used to play guitar. See. Si. That's right. Uncle a Jack guitar. used to play guitar. You want to do a couple more? Yeah, just one or two. Is that enough? Yeah, I think that's enough. Let's see. Uh, a movie or a book? A book. And then the last one... No, I really have a movie, Damon. Okay, movie. Movie, movie. Okay. I was wrong there. Okay, and then the last one. Let's get a good last one. Oh, this is a good one. I've never seen this one. A hammock or a tent? A tent. And there we go. <laughs> oh, that was good. Thank you all so much for joining in. Super that was fun. very good. I love it. Super good. Okay, of course, tacos or burritos? Oh... Taco. Yeah, Taquito. We got to get some tacos. I'm hungry, actually. Hey, so um, if you're just joining us, 
My name is Damon, and this is Uncle Jack, the Uncle Jack. And Uncle Jack is my great uncle. We live here in Southern California, and we started making videos for Uncle Jack about a year ago or more. We've been making little videos our, my whole life with Uncle Jack, more or less. We became mm -hmm. really close friends when I was about nine. And then we started a TikTok account uh, about four months ago. Mm -hmm. And within a couple days, he had a half a million followers. And today you've got 1.3 million followers on wow, TikTok. Wow, I just can't believe it. I can't, I just can't I believe can't. it. Uh, we've got like 27 million views on some of his videos. Anyways, the reason we do all of this is to afford Uncle Jack's life, right? Being 99 years old is not cheap. No, it's not cheap at right. all. It so isn't. If you can head over to our bio if you want to or you can in your lives. We've got, hey, good night, Marinus. Thanks for stopping by. Um, we've got a link in bio there to Jack's GoFundMe. We've also got an email address if you guys wanted to email Uncle Jack. So Uncle Jack loves to draw. That's one of his favorite things to do. This is one of his sketchbooks. <laughs> if you ever wanted a custom drawing from Jack, we can make that happen for you. There's some of Uncle Jack's really great drawings here. They're quite screwy. No, you do so good. Thank you, David. Way better than I can do. Oh, no, you can do that yes. good easy. So we decided we're going to do a children's book, actually. So we just started working. Yeah, Sunny Boy by the Seashore. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a little black kitty, and he's going to be holding a seashell. There it is. I like it. Here's one of Jack's poems. People say they love your poems, Jack. They say, a woodpecker pecked at a little round hole and made his home in a telephone pole. How, how good, some, Jack. Some, some kid said that when I was in grammar school. I never forgot it. Yep. Some clever kid. Danek, the story of a pigeon. The story of a pigeon. Look at what an incredible artist he is. So, anyway, so Jack loves to draw. So we typically love to do drawings. And we're going to work on a children's book together, which will be kind of fun. I and then, say it will. I think another thing that's fun is to do a little bit of an AMA. Can we answer a few questions, Jack? Mm-hmm. All right, great. So let's do an AMA right now, guys. If you have a good question for Uncle Jack, go ahead and drop it in the chat right now and I'll ask it to him. Um, definitely questions about Jack are great, but if there's something that's going on in your life that you'd love to ask Uncle Jack about, we'd love to give you some advice. So go ahead and drop it in here and we'll, work, we'll work on it. Would be nice. Some advice would be nice. So here we go, Jack. Uncle Jack, you've helped me stay positive through the hardest times of my life. And I can never say thank you enough. This is Quiverbone Oddities. Thank you so much for saying that. What is your favorite song? I'll record a cover of it for you and send it to you. Ooh, Jack, what is your favorite song? I can tell you if you like. Yeah, you tell me. You know what one of his favorite songs is? It's uh, Vaya con Dios. Right, that is, I forgot it. That's it, David, exactly, yep. that's it. And it's by Les Paul, <clears throat> excuse me, Les Paul and Mary Ford. And Mary Ford. That's right. Yeah. Vaya con Dios by Les Paul and Mary Ford. Uh, that would be really awesome if you did a cover of that. Hey, if you figure out how to do the guitar part too, I would love to, sh like, it's actually really hard because it's Les Paul. I was trying to figure it out and it's really hard actually. Mm -hmm. So I would love that. That's really sweet of you. Thank you. And Uncle Jack, this person says that they've helped you, all, that you have helped them quite a bit. Wow, I'm so glad. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad. I uh, like to help poor sick people out. Isn't that nice? And they can feel better and then they can be happy. That's very nice of you, Jack. Um, Jack, did you serve in World War II? Hunter Levy 17 asks. Hey, yeah, cool. I, we went through all that. Quiver, we just followed you too, by the way. So we're friends now. Thank you. Um, Uncle Jack was in World War II. Yes. You served in Australia. Yes. yes. And, and into the Philippines. Yes. He was drafted in World War II. That's right. And you were uh, in the medical corps. Yes. I was at 153 Station Hospital. That's right. Yes. Thank you for your service, sir. You're welcome. You're very welcome. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. A couple more questions and then we got to go to bed. But let's see what we got here. Uncle Jack, okay. do you play any video games? No, I don't get so. Uh -uh. No video games for Uncle Jack. Jack, how long have you had your hat? My what? Your hat. 
Oh, Your sombrero. God. Well, since how long has my brother been dead? Mm. Uh, uh, grandpa, so my grandfather was his brother, and grandpa passed away in 2010. That's how long I've had it. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, because he got it in, in Mexico. It's from Mexico. Let's see here. God bless you, Uncle Jack. I was fortunate to know my great-grandfather. He lived to be 98. Wow. Thank you for sharing, Drew. Uncle Jack, what countries have you visited in your life? Uh, Australia and up into the Philippine Island. That's right. Up there. And you were in the Panama Canal, too. Well, we just went through the Panama Canal. Yep. We didn't stay there. We just went through it, yes. And that was on the way to Australia during the yeah. war. Yes. Wow. Uncle Jack, uh, KSOV22 wants to know what is the secret of life? Jack, what is the secret? Oh. Oh, getting out and being active, being a naturalist. Mainly just being active and not sitting around and, and worrying about this and that. Being as active as you possibly could and eat dark chocolate. And sweeten with honey. Oh, yes, those things will do it. They will do it. As if by magic. That's good advice, sir. Yes. That's really good advice. Um, Smile Anna 04 says, How's the gun GoFundMe page going? Thank you for asking. The GoFundMe page is going really well. Uh, I think we've raised almost $20,000, Jack. Oh, wow. Yeah. So if you're able to help at the GoFundMe, it absolutely helps. We're planning long-term here. Uh, Jack brings in about $2,700 a month, and his rent here at the board and, or at the assisted living facility is $4,100 a month. Uh, and that's just rent. So above and beyond that, we're always trying to just plan for the future. We're actually um, hiring some companion companies to come in and uh, spend time with Uncle Jack on the days that I can't be here. Mm -hmm. um, so anything you guys can do to help would help us out. And thank you for asking, Smilena. Um, can you please say hello to me and give me some advice? I've been going through a rough time in my life right now. I just need some advice. Wyatt Turner. He says, can you please say hello to me? So say hello, Wyatt. His name Hi. is Wyatt. Hello, Wyatt. Nice to meet you, Wyatt. Um, how about we'll tag team this one. We'll both give him some advice together. Okay. Who is it? His name's Wyatt. So Wyatt, actually today I got a message from a fan of Uncle Jack's and he said that Uncle Jack's advice has been helping him a lot, that he's been putting his phone down and he's been going outside and going on walks and it's really helped everything that he's been going through. And I've been taking Uncle Jack's advice as well. I do two daily walks. So when I wake up after I have my breakfast, I go for a walk. I go for a one mile walk. And then at that's the, very good, yep. David. That's very good. And at the end of the day, I like to go for a walk as well. So it's just really well, I good. I would go for a walk at night. I do not be. You're not nocturnal. You'll get bit by a dog by doing that. Thank you very much. So be careful at nighttime yeah, if you like to walk go at, out night. at night. Uh -huh. Yes. So I hope that helps you out. If you're going through a rough time, definitely just take time for yourself. Right. Mm-hmm. Take time for What's yourself. That smoke? What's that from? So if you see hearts on the side there, that means people are liking your feed. They're sending you likes. Oh, I see. Yep. Yep, that's right. Um, Uncle Jack, how do you stay positive when things around you are crumbling down? You know, that's oh. a tough one. Get some, get a good old bottle of gin <laughs> and you will win. <laughs> I don't know. I never did that. Why did I say that? Well, because it rhymed. It rhymed. <laughs> it rhymes, right. <Yeah. laughs> oh. You know, I, I would say that going through hard times is part of life. Mm -hmm, it right? is. It's part, that's very well put. It's part of life. Yeah. Yep, you have to expect it. Life isn't all butterflies, you know. It isn't. Yeah. And that's kind of the purpose. The purpose here in life is to to go through hard times and learn things, right? Yes, right. Uh, one thing to observe about humans is that we're a mess. Yes. Every day we knock things over, we bite our lip while we're right, eating. Right, we do. We say the wrong thing, we get angry and yell yeah, at our we partners. Say the, right, we say the wrong thing frequently. Yeah. 
So it's, you have it's, to learn to say the right thing at the right time. Right. And it's in our... And do the right thing at the right time. Right. And how would you learn that, Jack? The way to learn that is to go through the hard times in your life with your eyes open and your heart open. And of course, you're, if you had good parents like I had, they, they teach you a lot of that. That's true. How to act in a hard time. Yeah. That's right. Mm-hmm. So if you're going to a, through a rough time in your life, Uncle Jack would advise you to get outside, spend some time in nature, and understand it's part of life. Right? Right. Well done. Thank you for stopping by, and I, and I hope that helps you out a little bit. Uh, all right, let's do two more questions, and then we got to go. How's okay. That sound? Hey, thank you all so much for stopping by. It's so cool to have you here. We appreciate oh, it. Oh, yes, we appreciate it so much. Yep. Um, here, let's see. Uncle Jack, what was your favorite sport to play? Uh, play play Tarzan and climb trees. That was my favorite that sport. That was his favorite. <laughs> uh, oh, Jack, we've got Panama in the house. We've got Costa Rica in the house right now. Nice to see you guys. Uh, Xinxing says, we appreciate your service. Hello from Liverpool, England. Wow. I want to wish you both good health. I love your posts. It's so positive and gives me amazing vibes. We're happy to help. It means a lot to us. Thank you. Hello from Ukraine. Thank you for helping me stay positive during this trying time for my country. Love you. Hey, Molly, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, we're following you right now. We just followed you back. And we're sending you our love and support. I can't imagine what life is like for you. And to know that our videos are helping you feel a little bit better means the world. Uh, it, it helps a lot uh, to know that. Um, hello from Argentina, Jack. Hey. Oh, um, Argentina. I'm from Argentina. Well, my family is. I was just in Buenos Aires. Yes, that's right. Dana, I keep forgetting that. That's right. Y podemos hablar castellano si quieres, Jack. Yes? Yo, sí. Podemos sí. hablar español. Sí. Yes. Poquito español. Yes. Y también, Uncle Jack, puedes cantar en español. ¿Verdad, puedes no? Puedes cantar. You can sing in Spanish. Sí. What, uh, can we sing everyone a song in Spanish? Do we have any good, do we have any good Spanish songs today? Oh, no, I don't. I swallow them all. You swallow them all? <laughs> okay. Can you think of a good wapango? wapango? Is there a good wapango? Caballo Pinto. How about Caballo Pinto? Caballo Pinto, Moscow. No quiero la frontera. Yo quiero el otro de monte. Pide la Dios que me muera. Eres mi amigo, no me gornaba. La mona preta y está cansada. And it goes on and on. <laughs> Bravo. Very good. Very good. Um, yes. You know what? Another piece of advice, if you're going through a rough time, is, is to sing. Right? Get to sing. sing. And if possible, learn to play a musical instrument, a guitar mm -hmm. or a fiddle. Whatever you like mm -hmm. in that. Yes. F finding or, a hobby or a mandolin. Yeah, exactly. Flower site, yes, we are very lucky to have each other. Repinese, hello from Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Nice to see you. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, Art Decade has to leave. Hey, good night. Nice to see you. Um, hey, someone was just asking if they could send you something. Yes, we have a P.O. box in our GoFundMe. There you can go ahead and drop, uh, or you can find our P.O. box and you can mail us a letter or if you wanted to send Jack a gift, um, that'd be how to do it. Um, all right, let's do one more good question, Jack, and then we will, we will okay, head no off. To, we will head off. I have to get going, actually. Ooh. It's time for Damon to go home. Um, I don't want you to go. Oh, you know what? I forgot. You're going to do a drawing real quick. Will you do a quick drawing? Yeah, but I did one. We got to do one more. We got to do one more. Do you have the energy to do one more? Not like... It not like hell. You want to wait till tomorrow? Yeah, mañana la misma Okay, we'll do it tomorrow. Okay. Um, hey, y'all. Thank you all for stopping by. If you're just checking in, go ahead and follow us up here. I think there's a way to follow us somewhere up here. Hello from Ukraine. My mom... 
Um, oh, I just lost that one. I don't know where it went. It went by too fast. Hello, Ukraine. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate it. Um, there we go. Uncle Jack, what is your opinion on Frank Sinatra? Oh, he was quite good. I liked some of his tunes, actually, you know. I liked some of his tunes, didn't you? I did. I'm a big fan. Yeah. Uh, can I make a song about Jack? Sure. Absolutely. Why not, Elijah? Absolutely. Um, have we always been close? Okay, that'll be our last question. So, Miss Delacole, thank you for your question. It's Mrs. Delacole. Nice to meet you. Um, did Uncle, uh, were we close? So, Uncle Jack and I became really good friends when I was about nine years old. Right, Jack? Yes. We became really good friends. And uh, we connected in, in many different ways, but Uncle Jack taught me how to hike and he taught me how to, taught me all about wildlife. Mm -hmm. How to catch lizards and snakes. How to catch lizards and snakes. And make little traps. Yes. For this and that. Yes. <laughs> and he taught me how to rhyme and he gave me a really positive outlook on life and he's a big part of my life. And Uncle Jack is 99 years old. You'll be 100 years old this year, Jack. Wow. What are you going to do? I don't know. We'll have 100. a great party. We'll have the great party over the montagna. Yeah. That's right. That's the plan. That's the plan. Um, all right, y'all. Well, it was very nice to spend time with you. And I hope very you, uh, nice. I hope you all have a beautiful evening. Um, oh, one last thing. I see one here. Advice to your 18-year-old self. I'm guessing that means that you're 18, right? One of the things that you tend to give advice on is for people to find a hobby. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about that a little bit? It's very important to find a hobby that interests you very much. Collecting money or whatever, ancient coins or whatever. It's very important for a hobby. Very important. Part of sanity. Find something that you connect with. Playing a musical instrument, drawing, whatever it is. But find a hobby that's yours, that you can yeah, do by yourself. Very interesting. Yeah, that interests you very much. Yeah. I feel sorry for people that don't have a hobby, you know? Right. Yeah, find something that's good for you that doesn't involve your phone, right? Hmm? That doesn't involve your phone. Right. Yes. Very true. Very true. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for stopping by. Take care of one another. Be good to one another. Mm -hmm. uh, if you have family that you can reach out to, give them a big hug. And reach out to your family and give them love. If you right. have any elders in your life, give them a call. They need your support. They need your love. Right? Right. Very true. Right. Yep. Okay, everyone. Have a beautiful night. This is Damon signing off. And this is Uncle Jack signing off. Good night. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Adios.